Good day, folks. Thank you for joining us here at Your Health. On today's program, we want to talk about the remarkable health-promoting properties of alpha-lipoic acid. Now, in the past, we've discussed alpha-lipoic acid and its ability to help the diabetic. But today's program is all about alpha-lipoic acid and its benefit for other conditions. It's really a fascinating subject, and I'm sure you'll want to learn all about alpha-lipoic acid. That's our program. But first, let's go to our news. Let's see what's happening in the health world. Abdominal fat increases the risk of osteoporosis. That's the finding of a new study from Harvard University. Osteoporosis, or brittle bones, has been associated with a lack of body fat in women. But the team of Harvard researchers found a certain type of obesity is a risk factor for osteoporosis. In the study, more than 50 obese premenopausal women were evaluated. The research showed that women with the most abdominal fat, but not necessarily the most total body fat, were more likely to have the early signs of osteoporosis. Oh man, this one will get your attention. Folks, for years we've thought overweight women have a lower risk of developing osteoporosis. Why? Because fat cells make bone building estrogen, plus carrying the extra weight strengthens bones. But this new study helps us understand that if a woman is carrying her extra weight around the middle, this visceral fat as doctors call it, creates a state of total body inflammation. The inflammation weakens bones and raises the risk of osteoporosis. So let's be clear, it does not appear that carrying extra weight around the hips leads to osteoporosis, but extra weight around the belly poses a higher risk. This is just one more example of the destructive effects of obesity and the total body inflammation it creates. Scientists are searching for ways to stop hearing loss in older adults, and they may have found some clues. In a study at the University of Wisconsin in Madison, researchers found oxidative stress is a primary cause of age-related hearing loss. Up to 28 million aging baby boomers will develop this condition by 2030. The study discovered free radical oxidative stress activates a gene called BAK. The gene causes the delicate nerve-based hearing cells to self-destruct. As the cells die off, patients notice a hearing loss. The researchers decided to take their study further and investigate whether dietary antioxidants could prevent this oxidative stress. They used lab animals for the second part of the study, and in general, antioxidants did not prevent hearing loss, but the researchers were surprised by one finding. Two potent antioxidants, coenzyme Q10 and alpha-lipoic acid, both protected the animals from the effects of age-related hearing loss. Folks, this is amazing. Coenzyme Q10 and alpha-lipoic acid help protect our hearing. Now, let's get the facts right. Age-related hearing loss is not the same as noise-related hearing loss. So we always need to protect our ears from loud noises. But in older adults, the discovery is important because these hearing cells are specialized nerve cells. So it's quite possible the same antioxidants could also protect us from other neurodegenerative diseases such as Parkinson's and Alzheimer's. Well, today on Your Health, we will discuss the amazing health benefits of alpha-lipoic acid, or ALA. You may remember a past program about alpha-lipoic acid and diabetes. Well, today our program is about the valuable role alpha-lipoic acid plays in our overall health. So stay tuned. We're going to learn a lot about the antioxidant alpha-lipoic acid. We'll be right back. <music> 